Hey cooks, the makers of the TV show MasterChef have come out with a line of small appliances to bring a little fun into the kitchen. Today, we're gonna to be using their mini pie and quiche baker to make some mini peach pies as well as some mini chicken pot pies. I can't wait, this is gonna be absolutely fantastic. So join me as we use the Master Chef mini pie and quiche baker to make us some fun little mini pies. So you guys know how much I love kitchen appliances. And when I run across something that allows me to take a classic dish and make it in a fun way, I'm excited to try it out. And this is no exception. So this is the Master Chef Mini Pie and Quiche Baker. It comes from the makers of the Master Chef TV series. This thing is so neat. You could make all kinds of little sweet and savory pies. It is pretty much just limited by your own imagination because the, the baker has little wells in here and you can fill this with fruit, you can make meat pies, you can make quiches, you can do all kinds of stuff. So let's get this out of the box so we can try it out. So here is our little pie baker and it comes with an instruction manual that has a few um, recipes in it to get you started. It also comes with a cutter. So this is gonna cut both the top and the bottom of our pie perfectly for the pie baker. So the first thing we're gonna make is mini peach pies. So I have some peach pie filling here and a, a pair of scissors, and I'm just gonna go cutting in here because I wanna break these peaches down a little bit because they're kind of big and we're making mini pies. So we want the peaches to be able to fit in there. <laughs> okay, so for the crust, we are going to be using traditional pie crust for the uh, bottom crust, and we're going to be using a puff pastry for the top crust. This will ensure that the top crust will uh, cook all the way. So we're going to flour our board a little bit. Woo! And we're gonna roll out our pie crust here. So this is gonna be our base. Hmm. Okay, so we have our pie uh, crust here and I'm gonna use this cutter that they provide. One side is small, one side is big. We're gonna cut six of these bad boys. So, woo. So then we're gonna make the top piece by using puff pastry. And puff pastry is just a little different from pie crust because it's rolled in layers. So it's gonna be really flaky for our top crust. So let me pull this out. And we're just gonna give this a quick roll. Okay, it's time to make some pies. So let's go for it, we got. So here's your little pie well. We're gonna put this in there and you wanna kind of press it in there gently so it fills the pie well. So we get our nice pie shape. And we're gonna go ahead and do that for all of these. And we're gonna fill each one of these with a tablespoon or so of our pie filling. Mmm. Mm. Then we're gonna take a little egg wash. This is egg with just a little bit of water in there. And we're just gonna egg wash the edges here so that they stick to the top. And we're gonna take our puff pastry top. We're just going to press it on here. Mmm. 
So we're gonna go ahead and close this down and we are gonna cook these, once it comes up to temp, we're gonna cook these six to eight minutes and uh, we're gonna have some little pies on our hands. So we'll be back. So we're gonna open this up and see how our pies look. Ooh, look at them! They're little mini pies. Ooh, they're hot. And so hot. <laughs> Woo! Mini pies. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. Look at that. Look at those little mini pies. So this time we're making some little chicken pot pies. We've already got our pie crust in here and I'm filling up our little pies. These are gonna be so cute. <laughs> we just want a little scoop. I made this uh, pie filling yesterday. And um, so you can actually make this stuff and freeze it. Once again, we're gonna dab a little egg wash here. And we're gonna cover our little pies with our puff pastry. Just press it down a little bit. And we're gonna close her down. So I got one of our little chicken pot pies for a taste test. So that will be our entree. And I got a little peach pie for our dessert. That'll be our dessert. So let's see how this is. Wow, number one, it's like flaky. Ooh, look at that. I see the, uh, the inside. Mm. Mmm. Mmm. It tastes like a little chicken pot pie. That is so fun. Mmm. It's delicious. <laughs> and here's our little peach pie. Let's get it. Let's get into that and see what we got going here. Here's our little peach pie. We got our peach filling. Mmm. 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 This is delicious. I'm sort of a crust person, so this is great for me. You want to come try them, boo? Okay, so first up, you got some chicken pot pie. Oh, great. We got peas and celery and carrots. Mmm. And that's the peach pie. Chicken pot pie is pretty good. If I didn't care, oops. <laughs> he ate my whole pie. Mm -hmm. So cooks, this is a master chef mini pie and quiche baker. I think this is really fun, particularly now that it's winter time because your kids are locked up in the house. It's freezing outside. It could be snowing, raining, whatever. And this is a great little activity to keep them happy and busy and fed, right? So I think this is a fun little appliance. It's a little novelty item that I really think your kids would find fabulous that they could have their very own little pies, right? They're cute. So, Master Chef, thank you very much for sending this. I really appreciate it. We had a great time making these mini pies. I'll leave a link down in the description if you want to take a look at this mini pie in Quiche Baker. Um, it's a lot of fun. Again, thank you. If you like this video, please subscribe below. Leave me a comment and a like and visit my website at amylearnstocook.com. I'm also on Pinterest and Twitter at Amy Learns to Cook. You can catch me in my Facebook group, facebook.com slash groups slash Amy Learns to Cook. And on Instagram, I'm at cooking with Amy. Mini pies. Mm, these are fun. <laughs>